Michael, rounding off the, the camp here in Germany with, with a game this afternoon, just give me your thoughts on how that went. Well, that was a reward for the boys because they've worked really hard this week, done over 40k within the football in the afternoon sessions. It's been a fantastic week. We came to a really secluded place in Germany um, and we've really enjoyed it. Staff and players mixing together. We've got some new pit players we wanted to integrate as well and some new ideas. So it was nice to finish the week off with a game. Uh, clean sheet again, so that's two games now with clean sheets and, and two goals. Abdullah showed his quality, he's shown that all week. Sam Lammers as well in the first half. So no, really delighted we've, we've come away with no injuries and, and a lot of players looking fit and strong. Yeah, and for the squad, how important are those minutes on the pitch at this stage given the number of, play the number of players who have come in? Yeah, and we're playing with really tired legs today. You know, as I say, over 40k this week we've put into their legs in terms of the football sessions, predominantly 85% of the work, but then some afternoons, some tough running in the heat here. Um, so you can see there was some tired legs today and the communication and the cohesion of the group, uh, when you're tired, it stretches out a bit. But no, I'm pleased. I think at the end of the week, just to have a game, we know we've played two behind closed doors friendlies, if you like, away from any of the public, and that's to allow the team to settle to the new ideas. But the next two weeks, we have some fantastic games against really high-level opposition that are going to test us. And um, I'm really looking forward to seeing the good work that we put in place now coming out in those matches. Yeah, and at this stage of pre-season, how much can you and the coaching staff take from games like these moving forward and, and really shaping the rest of pre-season? Well, we're just looking for people's legs to be looking stronger for the work that we've done. We're looking for little relationships within the team. We're looking for people to lay a marker down for the season. If you look, and two left-backs are, are really competing, two right-backs competing. The competition in the final third is really strong. So... It's nice, and when we get home from here, Nico Raskin will join the group, Tom Lawrence as well. Connor Goldson's not a million miles away, so the competition for places is really strong. I have to say, I think the young boys have done really well this week, and uh, I've been delighted with them, and they've shown that they want to be around the group, which is really important. They, they're showing a lot of personality. Of course, they want to play for Rangers, but do you have the personality to play? Do you have the fitness, do you have the mental strength to play and, and they've all come up well this week so I'm delighted with them as well.